great pranams to my guruji brahmashri pitama patriji and to all the masters here namaste right now i am sitting in chennai i just now finished one tamil session our last two hours the time is over i just told them bye bye i bye, have karma session okay uh, host now please can you please uh, mute everybody yeah okay so today is 52nd session on karma wow great day right so this is going to be like 52nd week for us 52 weeks is 52 wow it's one year data how much we have learned together i will not say only you have learned i have learned so much all of us are students here we all learn 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 great knowledge we had don't mind i'll be just sipping my coffee in between i want to give a best session today so today's karma session it is going to be short session because i don't have much bandwidth here to give for 2 hours 3 hours so i have shot it to only 1 hour today and how was the weekly goal finding energy i'm glad a lot of people are messaged me they have messaged the photos of the places where they are meditating a few people have messaged how they are performing it was so beautiful this week there is going to be another goal final goal of karma sessions okay the goal is i'm going to reveal it right away you have to be breath, be with the breath for the maximum time in a day that's all that is the goal try whatever is possible not only during your meditation wherever you are whatever you are doing you have to be always be conscious about your breath why the breath is called whom the breath is called guru and you have to train yourself to be maximum time be with whom guru no other person who is outside is a guru the first guru is your breath second third guru can be anybody the first guru is who is the first guru your breath is your first guru so always be with your breath don't depend on others others breath may stop but your breath is always there be with your breath good 40 people joined great from next week i am going to change the title of this workshop or a series or season whatever we call it as next 52 sessions next 52 sessions will be under the topic practical spirituality karma and reincarnation is over now the title will be practical spirituality what are we doing exactly here every week after week after week we are trying to practically implement the spirituality yes or no hmm i am getting messages tell me your opinions how is it <laughs> practicals it is already there our weekly goals are practicals so there is no separate practicals somebody is asking will there be practicals sir without only theory <laughs> tarun wow okay mukta ji hmm good so oh, don't mind this is i think the first session i am giving from mobile phone i have to hold the phone in my hand for one hour but i would love to do it yeah we are already doing practical spirituality but the title is going to be practical spirituality same in a different way like a old wine in a new bottle <laughs> they say right that is the quote so the one thing i'm going to show my best friend to all of you shall i show you aha 
my best friend so did you think he is a human <laughs> this is my best friend okay i am going to introduce to all of you one more person come here come see where is omsi i think please no kindly everybody please be on mute i don't know how to change the settings i'm getting some noises please be on mute i'll introduce you to my first spiritual friend oh, i have met him here he will come he will come in the meantime from next week and even from today i'm going to start the knowledge from not only this book this book is just giving me few points but my insights my analysis my discussion with my gurus their knowledge everything put together i am giving you the nectar how you are going to use it how you are going to implement it's totally up to you totally up to you your choice but giving the right knowledge is my duty and i am going to do that today make note there is going to be a lot of knowledge and wisdom so i have set the time for one hour our sessions always go beyond the time we decide depending on any many many factors let's see what did i learn for the past one week very important right so next week what is the goal being with the breath maximum time that is the goal Vamsi Krishna, he is from Chennai. Hi, masters. He is my first spiritual friend. You know how I met him in a Shivaratri when I am meditating in a center for two hours, three hours. So he was sitting next to me. He was meditating. After the session, I immediately saw him and asked, "Hey, who are you?" He said, "I am Vamsi." And I said, "Wow." He said, "Hi." I said, "Hi." we became friends and next day i went to his house that's what we do right once we become friends what we do chalo us ghar mein dekhunga kya hai and i found lot of books theosophical books lok sang rampa books third eye hermit and then he had lot of magazines osho times right in that time no mere paas paisa nahi hai mere paas dost hai So these those had lot of books, so I took lot of books from him, and he has shared all his knowledge. What is your message to all? So be you people being part of uh, this karma and reincarnation session, no? It was a wonderful thing, you know. The ending of the number of episodes, you know, it's it's coming to fifty two. So the angle of uh, pyramid also fifty two. So it is matching. karma and pyramid is both are you know angle is 52 52 a wonderful thing and uh, i request all people to continue doing meditation and do your exploration in spiritual thank you masters thank you my dear friend see what kind of friends we have i was thinking 52 weeks but he was telling is the angle is 51 degrees 51 minutes 52 no round off it is 52 that is what no he is a pyramid engineer so the way he looks at the world is 52 now for him everything is 52 number 51 52 so he said the 52 is the angle of the pyramid wow that's a new thing no i have learned today and this travel has taught me lot morning i went to studio and we had that q and a sessions in tamil language i met lot of friends and one one great thing is yesterday i read lot of stuff from this book we had a swadhyaya session with few of the spiritual friends see wherever we go we have to make find make time find time don't give excuses i could have simply said i have travel i don't have time but i made time for this session and extra three sessions generally i'll do only one but this travel this is my fourth session we can always find time but we don't we should not find excuses 
we should not find excuses we should find reason and time to do things okay i'm going to introduce few terms today so next week goal we are clear right being with the breath maximum time whenever you remember be with the breath when you meditate you are anywhere with the breath but you are doing any work be with the breath be with the breath be with the breath get practiced surrender to your breath surrender to your guru be more time with your guru then see what happens we don't know what will happen right we are going to experiment yeah. so the first word i am going to introduce to all of you today is psych p s y c h e psych what does it mean psych means soul psych means what soul psychism means study of soul study of soul is psychism so this book is about soul and the study of soul and we know we are the soul we are consciousness we are souls we are not this body and mind so we are all born we know that we have taken a physical body but who created my soul and what is this soul called in sanskrit atma so this atma is getting created by a greater atma that is called purnatma one purnatma created this atma like my mother gave birth to this physical body my purnatma gave birth to my soul hamshatma from a purnatma the small hamshatma is born we all are born our souls are born so the soul is born from where from a purnatma we don't know where it is and there is a loka called purnatma loka all the purnatmas go and sit there from that place they keep releasing hamshatmas and they take birth in multiple places the first place where we all land into is called mineral kingdom first kingdom the base zero kingdom i can say second is plant kingdom third is animal kingdom fourth is human kingdom that is where we are all there right so if i asked today no i told to two people i know all your past lives they said wow sir please tell me all your past life i said you have been plants you have been animals you have been minerals they were like <laughs> so what is our past in our past life we are what we are plants we are animals we are minerals and some humans comparatively because human lives we generally take from 300 to 3000 300 is permittable but we take more and more more so many lifetimes we continuously take there's a strange fellow standing in front of me full face mask i was just looking at him is he here to attack me <laughs> no he is just about to wear his helmet my awareness is in both place so when we are born into the mineral kingdom what all the minerals we know at least the minerals i know is crystals thank you i got mobile stand wow okay i think my hand should be good i will hold it for one hour no problem this is my new experience i don't want to miss it so when you are born in the mineral kingdom the minerals what are the minerals at least the minerals i know a few crystals so people ask me sir should i buy crystals or should i use crystals are they good it is your past 
Crystals are your past. You can use it. Why? And once you take many, many, many eons as crystals, when you are born, when our souls are born, we are only born with one cell. Then, with our observation, with our learning, we multiply that cell into millions of cells. So, whose responsibility it is to multiply the cells is us. The Purnatma will not do anything. It just created you. See, when your child is born, you take care of him very nicely. You give him food, this, that, extra week, take care. Sometimes up to 60 years, people take care. And he would be 80. But Purnatma will not interfere. The way it works, we must understand the law. The way it works is, it creates for what? Not for fun. It wants to learn everything from Amshatma so it can improvise in its creation. Upgradation. We buy new mobile phones. We add extra RAM to our laptops. We change the processor. Why? We want more speed, more upgradation. The Purnatma wants to learn everything from you. Anything you do. One person asked my Guruji, Patriji, Sir, my father has expectations. My mother has expectations. What should I do? And he answered, your Purnatma also has a lot of expectations. What a beautiful answer. Yeah, your Purnatma has expectations on you. You have to do something so it continuously learn. Do new. I'm sure all 50 of us and people who watch later these videos, no thousand plus, we are all doing something different every week. And all our Purnatmas will be very happy. No doubt about it. We are continuously learning something. We are continuously doing something. New, 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 new in the field of spirituality. So when the Purnatma is creating an Amshatma, the greater soul is creating a small soul, how is the communication happening? From how, what is the mechanism? What is the science behind it? How the real communication is happening? It is happening through a rays. We call sun rays, right? One small ray. There are so many. So the Purnatma created a ray. That comes first to the mineral kingdom. That ray is always there. It means my Purnatma's ray is always with me. Always connected. Anything I learn, anything that comes new, it will extract. It means it will take a copy of it. Experience. Whatever you experience will be with you. It will take additionally from you. It is not going to go away from you. The Purnatma is able to communicate with you and take everything. But are we able to communicate with Purnatma? That's a billion dollar push. So it's been a one-way traffic until now. And why the Purnatma can do something, right? So we can communicate with Purnatma, it will not. Then what should I do to be in communication with my Purnatma, my creator? What should I do is sadhana. Through your sadhana, you move from mineral kingdom to plant kingdom, the Purnatma will not interfere. It will only guide you, visibly, invisibly. So it is your effort, it is my effort to evolve. And during that evolution, there's a lot of struggles we face, right? You have to sit, meditate, cut the thoughts, read books, these, that, all the karmas has to wash. But all these learnings, again, the Purnatma will take. It is continuously learning from millions and trillions of souls it has created. And every time it creates new, it is creating with the knowledge it has acquired recently. Upgradation. That is the purpose. And what is my goal? What is your goal? Our past is what? Minerals, plants, some humans. So do we need past life regression? If you now sit and go in the past life regression, you will find yourself as a coconut tree. Are, pay kar diya. Now I understood I am a coconut tree. Hey, ho gaya. 
my coconut tree. Two thousand is gone. Now I am a coconut tree. And again, I meditate, meditate. Past life regression. I go and I see my like a hen. Cock, 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 cock. Hey, am I a hen? Wow. Once I am seeing I am a bird. Sometimes I am a king. Sometimes I am a queen. Acha na king queen. Why am I again born? So in our past we are animals. We are minerals. We are amethyst ones. We are clear quartz ones. Such a beautiful science. No more about you. Wow. Okay, now I know my past. What is my future? I have to become like my Purnatma. By not going and merging inside it, by just going beside to it and say, "Hey, I have come to this level. I have learned so much. You have taken everything from me without me knowing. Now I will also create. I will also grow. That will be our future." So when the Purnatma creates a Hamshatma, there is a ray, just like a sun rays. That Purnatma. can also be called as cosmogenesis genesis is means recreation recreation from the cosmos of the cosmos by the cosmos cosmogenesis so every ray it creates the purnatma creates hamshatmas and it is always in constant touch who said you are alone you are always being watched my dear friend you are always being checked we may do thousand things here but the purnatma is not interested in everything it is only interested in anything new experiment you have done anything new knowledge you have gathered and it will acquire it filter filter will happen rest all kachra will stay in your mind it doesn't want kachra it only wants a right knowledge new experiments that is what the purnatma will continuously take from you. and these rays are called communication lines and how the data transfer will happen through the atoms through the atoms in the ray see the purnatma has lot of knowledge lot of energy it has created you but when you have to grow you have to travel in the direction opposite to its direction yes or no from infinity a ray has come you are in the level 1 now if you want to go from level 1 to level 2 you are going against the current against the current from infinity to 7 6 5 4 3 2 1 it has created you but from moving from 1 to 2 2 to 3 you are going against your purnatmas current that is going to be a big challenge my dear friends why the atoms the energies of the purnatma is stronger than what you have why should i meditate i must meditate so my atoms become more strong so i can evolve in the opposite current of my purnatma will my purnatma help me no way it will only guide you it won't say okay i'll pull you you can just aram se come up no because the every struggle we face through going up is a new learning for us as well as our purna remember this so our evolution is in our hands our growth is in our hands if somebody or anybody of us when we go through some struggle you know what will be the result the light inside us will grow we have to travel back the path because that is the only path we know there may be many paths i don't know but whichever path the purnatma has given me i have to travel back in the same direction <coughs> to travel back we need three things make a note to travel back we need three things the first thing that we going to need is the will power and this will power will not generate just like that it is it will take many 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 eons 
many lifetimes but it is a must needed power three powers we need will power is the number one we cannot achieve even small manifested things even in the physical world without will power similarly for us to go back to our purnatma we need will power second is the power of love that is power of attraction that power we need the purnatma will not just emit light it won't just create you it also attracts what it attracts all the learnings you are getting it is going to attract back right if it doesn't have that magnetism of attraction it cannot learn what you are learning here so the purnatma has will power also power of attraction third is knowledge three things are needed my dear friends will power the power of love and attraction knowledge with these three things we can go back to the source of where we got created but we should start working on it so what is the first thing what is the first thing we have learned is will power how are you going to develop your will power and where we can develop the will power every time when you think you need to achieve something you need to stick to it until it happens by continuously doing that continuously doing one after the other one after the other experiments your will power keep on increasing you should not give up my dear friends if you are giving up you are also giving up your will power never give up let it take its own time but don't give up if you see my first few recordings i used to always say i want all torcom books to come to me i have said many times in my sessions today it manifested somebody told me sir you are so rich you got all the books shall i tell you one fact all these books was gifted to me i was ready to buy but somebody gifted me my cousin gifted me he didn't take money i told him no you have to he said no please and he found out all the websites ebay here there all the used books somehow he got all the books i showed this book to few of the friends here they said it is not looking like used books this is like a new book i said i don't care whether it is a new or used as long as i can read the material from it so the will power you will increase more and more every time every time the will power increases when you stay stick on to something for the manifestation and the will power only increases if you focus on material things i want something i will try everything to get it that trying has to be 100% forget about the result whatever you try it has to be 100% effort there your will power increases don't care about the result result is not in our hands trying is in our hands we think only if it manifest then it's success manifestation is not success manifestation is when you try 100% that is success the scoring will be given to you based on how much you tried not how much you scored that is how it works the law works like that in the higher worlds so for me trying is 100% important i just gave the session here the right spot neo we are all in the pyramid can you see the pyramid that's a beautiful pyramid we are in the pyramid and i just thought to go down and give the session but i just opened to check the speed of the internet who it is more than 100 mbps mobile data then i thought i am not going anywhere i am sitting right away here giving the session 
because i want to give the session today at any cost i don't want to miss it one message i would have simply messaged unable to take but i don't want to miss it i want to give it 100% try they agreed whoever is running this place they agreed for one hour one hour extension i can sit here and give my session they happily agreed they helped thanks to them so that will power every time you have to have a goal you have to stick to it then your will power increases how many weeks we have a weekly goal how much will power we all have increased forever all of our will power has increased as yes or no so that is going to help us to find the path back to our purnatma everything has a great relationship and second is the power of love power of attraction how are we going to increase that it comes from your anahata chakra power of attraction love it will happen by doing more service what kind of service without any expectation you have to help others for their growth why then my power of love power of attraction will increase then that will help me to find my own purnatma that will help me to evolve mujhe kya farak padta hai people ask no why i have to go and teach i will meditate yeah but your power of love will not increase unless otherwise you are in service give 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 without expectation then you are in the great path of service third knowledge hai oh knowledge knowledge we all know right the importance of knowledge today i met few people they all were very happy they said sir ayappa sir i am very happy to meet you through you we came into meditation you should see their excitement i was not very excited when she spoke but the moment she took a book out of the bag and said i am also carrying a book then i became excited are wah because that is going to help her to find her purnatma not by looking at me not by meeting me but following the truth it is going to help her I'm so happy she said sir i have a book like wow it's small kids show no i have this doll <laughs> she was showing me the to meet me here she traveled 50 kilometers in this hot sun with her kid and the another fellow traveled 30 kilometers just to come and see me to attend my session not to see this face <laughs> nothing is there in the face but to take the knowledge to do group meditation to inside this pyramid such a beautiful pyramid whenever i come to chennai i ensure i come here because this is the most beautiful place i just come here i relax here lot because way back there my my mother's home there is no pyramid so what i did this time i took a pyramid i did a experiment there nobody meditates so what i did i took a 2 feet pyramid assembled it without anybody's knowledge i kept it above the 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 rack and when i slept i could go into a deep sleep very quickly generally it takes more time there because the room will be all filled with their thoughts but now that room is cleansed and i checked with four people who slept there everybody's sleep is deep are yaar ek experiment ho gaya pyramid ka experiment i will never leave a opportunity to experiment and there's a new pyramid that is born there such a low vibes place because people have eaten non vegetarian like anything for eons here the vibrations will be low but what is our goal finding energy was that our goal or no yesterday so what should i do i should install a pyramid and find energy there new dimension right people thought 
okay whatever is existing we should find energy i created a pyramid and then i found energy there i was sticking to my goal my dear friends of always finding energy and i made everybody laugh like anything today met 20 people they all burst into laughers because that is missing in their lives everybody serious serious people i don't like serious people seriousness is needed but always serious kya yaar smile laugh the joy is missing so i ensured everybody smile yesterday night one hour uh, they all burst into laughter continuously then aram se i slept knowledge is the third power we need why i need that in order to go back to my purnatma will power increases when i apply the law of manifestation power of attraction will increase when i do more service any service without any expectations knowledge increases when i listen to other masters experiences when i read books and i am continuously doing when today i have learned about these three things i did a check on myself am i increasing my will power absolutely yes every week after week and within that week i will try to manifest lot of things i lied to my mom i said the three days i am going to be in chennai only one day there will be sessions two days i will be with you first day after a few hours i took the book ran to my friend four hours i sat with him okay had a lot of discussions about the book and then i went to my home and i gave a good face to my mom she was like can't do anything with this guy and today from morning i disappeared <laughs> i am yet to go back to home morning 9 o'clock i left session after session after session after session and she said sunday good na nobody is coming i said three people message they are meeting me on sunday abhi gaya what to do i love to meet people they want they love to meet me so i told them no whoever is coming come with kids that's all play together first thing remember what is the first thing we have learned what is that you can't mute right unmute <laughs> the first thing what we are going to learn <laughs> is will power somebody's voice i can listen who is that i want them to mute <coughs> somebody is coughing hmm how could one person get power ah uh, who is that black sheep i am unable to find it the host muted me too since i am in mobile no tila ji first time i am using a host i have to will power is first 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 continuously be a creator when you are a creator what do you create new things something new what should i create your kitchen is a laboratory create something your book is a creative thing no create something learn this point that point apply experiment on someone i did a experiment put up pyramid then see then ask others how was the sleep did you sleep well they said very deep sleep very peaceful sleep and then i said upar dekho ek pyramid hai they said oh if i would have told them before then there is no maja in my experiment because then my mind will say you already told them that is a pyramid that's why they had a deep sleep so the experiment has to be secret secret so will power you have to continuously increase by by doing small manifestations now and then continuously second kya yeah, second law of attraction or power of love 
service 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 i want to increase my law of attraction to lot so these three days i am in service i know how much time to give to others how much time to give to my parents so i have to satisfy everybody but i am not going to compromise third knowledge i i always swim in knowledge see there are many gurus from where i continuously learn i learn from everybody but there are few people who will give lot of insights to me and they are calling me and said hey did you i think i heard you are reading some books what are the points see people are coming continuously they are calling discuss let's discuss what points you have learned when i shared the points they started sharing their experiences these points why they don't know english i know english got advantage they want me i want them that is how the knowledge increases and anything i want to learn and follow in my life i will add that in my checklist i have a big checklist every day before sleep i will check whether did i do this today or no because who is going to pay my reminder my dear friends who is going to pay my reminder you expect me to someone will come is my alexa my reminder no small notepad or checkbook checklist or something that is going to be a reminder that should remind you every day did you do all these things yes or no honestly answer no cheating there that will tell you that will show you where you stand where you don't stand in this checklist you should write observe the breath every moment maximum possible we never say 100% not try to your best one person said sir i am very depressed i am not able to do meditation so i said why did you come to meditation he said i have many other depressions so i said sir you are finding many depressions outside now after meditation now you are finding depression here so kindly drop being depressed unable to meditate he is depressed sir i am unable to read books i am very depressed i am unable to share experiences i am depressed are baba you chodo no depression ka chodo don't find depressions everywhere find opportunities everywhere the three things we have learned you know when i was reading this point suddenly a knowledge got strike if purnatma is sending amshatma through rays what about our sun rays all these years i was just thinking sun rays is one direction sun is emitting it is hitting everywhere that's it now my perception has changed today morning this is my new learning bakwas hai kya sun simply emitting emitting no it is emitting every ray and through that same ray it is getting back the knowledge on which it is hitting wow what a point kamal kar diya aap beautiful blast for me today such a beautiful point what about moon what about stars oh my god so look at all the dimension it is opening so then i thought how much knowledge this fellow sun will have he will have everything about all of us for many eons many people who are born all yogis rishis every planet in this milky way the sun is continuously emitting rays learning everything chodunga nahi suraj ko catch him and once in my meditation i remember i went to surya loka i met sun had a communication with him and once my mother my friend's mother died she went to surya loka then i thought what a great soul she is but my perception about the sun has totally changed now now i'm going not going to leave because now my awareness is more on the sun s u n sun not my s o n sun <laughs> yes u n sun since now i am ready to learn more why the sun will not give me when you are ready the master will appear are you ready that's the question you need to ask i am ready chodunga nahi suraj ka 
पकड़ो लर्न लर्न हाउ मच ही विल हैव यार मे बी दट सन हेज ऑलरेडी शेड एवरीथिंग इन साइड मी सो शुड आई गो एंड फाइंड इन सन और इन साइड मी दीज क्वेश्चन आर स्टार्टेड नाउ एल डू बोथ टू चेक इधर रहे और उधर रहे See, one new point has opened dimension to other new points. People tell no, that uh, the minerals and the plant kingdoms they don't have soul; they have only have consciousness. When Purnatma create Hamshatmas, there is only one cell. It is called pure consciousness. Any mineral or any crystal or any plant it will not think depending upon the outer circumstances it will only react if a energy comes to the crystal it multiplies if any negative energy comes it attracts and keep it inside it crystals only react and plants if we go with an intention to cut it it will have fear if you have intention to go and hug it it will emit love you are very pure that is why we should have a lot of plants and crystals with it that is how we are always connected with the purest of us once we are that be with yourself how <laughs> be with crystals and plants be with the nature then you are with the true nature people say no that you are with the be with your true nature i never understood now i got more clarity what is my true nature is minerals and plants my breath i'll be more with it from today more we are with it but we have to be more be with your purest form it will remove all the impurities from animal kingdom the soul starts there the karma starts are today karma session one karma point came wow ah ah from animals the soul starts so the karma starts accountability starts but does animal have karma that was my question then i got the answer no it was confusing animals have soul then why there is no karma because no animal has single soul they are in the form of group souls one soul Take ten bodies, fifteen, five, eight. So one act cannot be act of everybody. So there is no karma there. Then I got again this clarity. Animals don't have karma. Hmm. The dogs, no, the big seven eight dogs will have will share the same soul. It takes seven bodies. Parallelly, parallel souls. but when it comes to the human body gan case ek hi soul hai your karma account starts accountability starts meter start ho gaya auto meter chatang <laughs> you are answerable whether you can say i didn't know law is law we know that we have seen in lot of movies there may be some exceptions but law is law so your karma account starts the moment you are human how many more years yaar we have to be dwelling in the law of karma get out of it the cycle because we have to go there is a long journey get enlightened quick develop three skills will power power of love knowledge for that continuously create manifesting give service to others increase the knowledge know where they spoke about energy my dear friends so surprising to me they never said you need energy to go back to your purnatma no knowledge is enough service is enough will power is enough that will automatically fetch energy the importance is not for the energy the importance is for knowledge you must do sadhana 
So why why we must do sadhana? Because we know not knowingness, beingness matters. Because knowingness, you are different. The knowledge is different. The object is different. Beingness, the knowledge is inside me, and the object is me, and my goal is also me. So beingness matters, not knowingness. For that, we need dhyana sadhana. But in order to go back to our purnatma, these three things are ultimately important. You must focus. Get enlightened quickly. Focus. One day we will all. One lifetime is more than enough. We follow the principles. Have simple goals. Achieve it. Do sadhana. Get enlightened. Going back to your Purnatma is important. You cannot avoid it. You cannot delay it. Why take another lifetime to get enlightened? Why not this lifetime? So this is all the new learnings for me in the last one week. The last week session was also awesome. A lot of people messaged. Amrut Milgaya. Abhi, this session is again awesome session. Because all my learnings I have shared, the new knowledge, all the atoms inside us has to become powerful with more energy. Then we can travel in the opposite direction of the current. The Purnatma is not going to pull you up. Nobody is going to pull you up. Any guru, they will only guide. Any guru outside, they will only guide. But who is going to help you? You. So why are you damn depending on others? Go to some session, learn the knowledge, get out. Don't get attached to a person. Attached with your breath. Breath. Attached to the book. <laughs> book. Book is giving me knowledge. Today also I told, I'm going to show my best friend. I showed the book. Why? The book is only wanted to give knowledge, nothing else. My book is very focused. You open, I'll give knowledge. You don't open, it won't, it won't say anything. Those are my new learnings. Today, in the Q&A session, no, it happened in PMC Tamil studio. One guy asked such a beautiful question. Really hats off to him. He said, how to find Purnatma? Yeah, good question, Malikar. How to find Purnatma means when you unfold, when you go back in the path by efforts, more efforts, facing all the struggles, step by step, you become close to your Purnatma. When your willpower increases, when your knowledge increases, the power of attraction increases, slowly you will know. I found out who was my Purnatma many years ago. And also I found out who was the Paripurnatma of my Purnatma. I mean, who created my Purnatma. And hierarchy I found. Then I found out why I am born. What is my purpose? What I should do? So I will travel back in that path. And I will also become another Purnatma. What did I do? Did I do anything special? No. I was just following what is thought. Principles. And everything is revealed automatically. Effortlessly. You will come to know. So today, that question, one guy asked this. Sir, we have to become aware to achieve something. And he said, what will happen to that awareness after we become that? I said, we will become that awareness. He said, I'm thinking I'm a body and I'm now being aware to understand that I'm a soul. So then he said, what if after becoming soul, what happens to the awareness? I said, you are going to become that awareness. What a beautiful answer I got. Channeled. I didn't know that. 
I said, you are going to be the embodiment of awareness. Previously, you thought awareness is something separate, so you have to apply. Now you applied and you became that. So beautiful. Thanks to that guy. You know, sometimes these questions will provoke me and I will come to know more about me. If you have not asked that question, I would have not known this answer. And who is that awareness? Consciousness. If that consciousness is in the body, we say body consciousness. If the consciousness is in the soul, we, saw, we tell soul consciousness. And if it is not in any of the element, we call it as unconsciousness. And when you are that, then you are consciousness. Research, research, learn, learn. So from next week, our sessions are going to be practical spirituality. This is what the name I got. I did not give the name Nam Namakaran. It has got, just I got it. That's all. And I, I personally think it suits me more and all of us because we are trying to become more practical, not just theoretical, right? We are understanding one thing we are applying by weekly goals, by checklists. How many of you are following checklists end of the day? Thank you, Tilaji. Okay, how many of you are following some checklist? If you really want to grow, if you want to really measure, only when you measure, you grow. You must follow some chance checklist. Medit did I meditate today? Did I read a book? Did I follow these? Whatever it is. The bigger the list, better. But if it is smaller initially, it will be easy for you to get encouragement to fill it every day. If you don't fill it, don't sleep. Be strict. Sometimes end of the day when I'm filling the checklist, there'll be two, three things which is missed. I thought, okay, let me finish this and then put an S and then I'll go to sleep. Is it not helping me? You have to, you have to push yourself. You have to help yourself. Don't expect some external force will come. See, I'm coming weekly once telling something and going. The rest of the six days, you have to help yourself. Even today, you have to help yourself. Give service whenever is possible. Why? It is going to increase the power of love. That is going to help you to go back to your Purnatma. Apply everything what you have learned. Why? It is going to increase your willpower. Why do I need it? Because it is going to help me to go back to my Purnatma. Read books, increase the knowledge. When I share, when I take questions from others, my knowledge becomes more refined. Why do I need? Because it will help me to go back to my Purnatma. Wow. One hour ogia. And today, no Q&A. Our celebration will be silent celebration. 52 weeks over, my dear friends. I really thank you, all of you. Know? I know many people who have attended more than 40, 45, 50. Put approximate number. Now I want to see in the chat, how many sessions have you attended? Live or later you have seen. I just want to see who topped it. No competition, na? Huh? Hmm. What's the number? Are direct message nahi, Sukhanji. You have to publish everywhere. 20, 22. All. Usmaji, you have watched all the 51 sessions and you are here in the 52. Wow. I'm just looking into the chat. I'm not able to. More than 50, 43. Supriya, wonderful. Mm, 39. Around 52. Yeah, around 52. This is 52. How can it be around 52? <laughs> Such a beautiful journey we all had. This journey is not going to leave. As long as I have breath, I'll be continuously doing sessions. Okay. I, I recently, I have decided to give sessions in Telugu. And you know what is going to be the title? Atma Yogam Loki Mahapravesham. The greater journey into the soul's knowledge. Then immediately few people said, Sir, please, Tamil. Others said, Sir, why not Kannada? They said, Hare, it is not my choice. I'm getting that to do. 
and one person said okay na sir english you please end it same time you do telugu <laughs> then i said what by my life 50 people will kill me uh, they are all enjoying my session i don't want to close this vijay except some all very nice so our sessions are not going to end add subtitles in the telugu i don't know how to add sneha teach me the youtube i don't know how to enable it so our session practical spirituality same time at mean only today i have shifted the timing from next week 7 to 9 we are going to continue another 52 sessions i will guarantee after that i don't know because initially i told you know to all of you 100 sessions just now title is changing so another four sessions no mukta ji i am not going to stop don't worry 104 sessions we will do today 52 ho gaya what a beautiful answer vamsi gave you no know? 52 is the angle of pyramid and telugu i don't know what time when to start but i am going to start and rest of the languages i don't know whether i'll do or no but this knowledge has to go to everybody sharing 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 thank you my dear friends i am in a center it's not my home so i have time restrictions so they are very happy to have me whole day there are other people who will kill me if i just keep on being here i have to balance everything because we are into very practical spirituality balancing of energy so remember the goal the next week all of us we are going to have a beautiful goal of being with our guru for the maximum time and who is the guru breath if you are unable to say i am getting busy i am not able to do more meditation then you would be bored with your breath and when you are awake when you are traveling when you are reading book whatever you do try more 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 to be with the breath and share 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 what is happening what is the experiences i hardly see people messaging me in whatsapp what happened why don't you go no in the description of the youtube there is a link click and i am available share your experiences i want to learn from all of you don't only share to your purnatma i have shared with me also because my purnatma also have a lot of expectations let us all give great knowledge but again i will tell you all of our purnatmas will be absolutely more happy thank you idea friends and today session again we will definitely add in the youtube thank you very much have a great day we'll again next week we meet with a new title that same face same knowledge same weekly goals nothing is going to change new title practical spirituality so any suggestions i am open to listen thank you my dear friends bye bye